Well, their offensive line is very athletic. You know, they're they're the athletic as offensive lines we've seen, maybe as good as we've seen, you know, maybe since I've been here. They're they're uh, you know across the board, and uh, you know they got depth. They've got a couple guys that. Um, you know, played a lot of football. They're backing up, so you know their, their offensive line is good, and and their tailbacks are, you know, they have multiple ta- tailbacks, and you know they're all talented in their own way, and they can run them in and keep them fresh, and you know get them the ball, and you know just a lot of a lot of skilled athletes. Receivers are good, uh, big, physical. Uh, they compete extremely hard. You know, I think their offense, and I'm sure on defense are the same way. We just don't watch that, but. Um, they compete and, and play hard and compete hard and, and uh, you know it's a challenge. Well, you know the thing they do a good job of and the thing that they've done a good job of is you know they protect him. You know they've got a good offensive line and they they uh, you know they're gonna they're gonna keep you know some people in and protect him and, and they do a good job giving him uh, you know things that he's good at and things that he can do and, and uh, you know it's it's like any other offense if you can get the run established which they've been able to do it's you know puts a lot of stress on you for the play action passes and and uh, so I guess it, you know it's that's where it starts but uh, you know he you know we've only seen him one game so it's all we can really you know really go by but he had a good game and he was on target and uh, looked like he handled the offense well and you know everything you see on tape he looked Well, you know, I think they're they're physical too, but you know, I guess I would say they're they're good all around athletes. You know, and I, you know they run well. The thing you see is if they pull their two tackles, and both tackles run extremely well. So, you know, from that you say they're athletic. I know they're physical. They compete, you know, real hard. Um, what do we do? You know, I think we do what we do. I, you know, it's going to come down to the trenches and who can battle who in the trenches. And you know, I think we've got to ask our guys to go in there and, and play hard and play physical and play low and. You know, it's not going to be anything different than any other game. Uh, you know, if you can win the battle in the trenches, you got a chance. But, uh, you know, the challenge is, is a little bit greater than it usually is just because they are good athletes, good players. And and, uh, and there's a number of them. I, I read Tommy's quote, I think, uh, somebody sent me that, that he had uh-huh. said that they have four potential first-round <coughs> draft choices on their, on their front five. So I don't know which one wouldn't be, but, you know, <laughs> <laughs> but they're, they're very good. Well, you know, we just feel like he's a good football player. You know, he's one of those guys that, you know, he's a natural football player, plays well. And right now, you know, he's going to be uh, working in safety with Anderson Russell and, and uh, you know, splitting time there. And then when we're in the nickel package, one of those two will be at the star and the other one will be at safety. So they'll both be on the field. And, and But he's, you know, he had a good year last year. We thought we thought he played well last year and had a good off season and, and uh you know, he just, he's a guy that we feel like, you know, one of those guys when you say, who's your 11 best football players, you know, we feel like he's one that needs to be on the field somehow. Sure. And he's a big kid, so he can play an outside backer, you know, a nickel, star, whatever position for us. You know, we, you know, well, I guess we'll see this week a little bit more. You know, last year I thought he played the pass pretty well. I thought he was pretty effective. And, you know, like I said, he's, he's kind of a natural player. You know, he, he's pretty natural and does things instinctively. So that you always like that. Now, you know, does he have the speed and, you know, you know, go up for the ball and all those things? You know, we'll find out. We really didn't see a whole lot last week. But. Yeah, like I said, I think, you know, we sit around, we talk about who your 11 best player. We got to get our best players on the field, whether it's nickel, dime. Yeah. You know, if we got a whole bunch of DBs, we played a lot of dime before. Uh, if we got a whole bunch of linemen, we'll play more base. But, you know, I think he's a guy that we always, every time we ask, you know, who's 11 best player, he always comes up in the top 11. So, you know, when a guy comes up in the top 11, you probably, you know, we're just trying to work out and get him on the field as much as we can. I mean, we need a huge game, and and, it, and it's those guys are in. It's a tough assignment for them. We've talked to a lot of coaches out in the Pac-10, and you know that's that's what it comes down to. Our 
you know, our wide, our uh, DBs are going to have to play wide receivers. They're going to have to go out on them, and sometimes they're going to be on the island, and you know, mm -hmm. you've got to do it because you've got to get some people down in the box to stop the run, and you're going to ask them to do that, and then you're going to ask them to, to get in and fill in the run because they're going to get a box set and, uh, you know, pound you into the boundary and do those things where your your DBs have got to come up and, and be fill players and hit people and, and do those things. So it's a, you know, I, in fact, I talked to uh, – a couple of coaches today that have played them, you know, every year, and, and you know, it's just, you know, it's a tough assignment for the DBs in a game like this. Uh, probably we'll have to, you know, after we watch the film tonight. I mean, we had a pretty good practice tonight. And, you know, we'll, we'll start getting an idea within the next, you know, next couple of days. You know, we're kind of approaching it. Both of them are going to play, and, and uh, you know, not really get too involved in it right now. But we'll. You know, we'll take a look. We're grading practices and see who looks the best. But we're going to need both of them, and we're going to count on both of them. And, and um, you know, Jamil's been the star. And, and, uh, Anderson's been the safety back there in, the, in our nickel. And we'll be playing a lot with nickel this week. So. And, and really improve the passing aspect of his game, and we'll continue to keep doing that. And works very hard at that. You know, and, and just fortunate that he has some really good speed and he's a pretty good natural runner. So, again, you always got to walk the line of um, in any game, do you? We, everybody knows the guy can run. So, how much does he, does he run or should he run? And I think that all depends on how games are going and, you know, and what's demanded at, at, at a particular moment. You know, it, it's. You know, it's hard to say when you're going into a game you got a plan to do this or do that, but the game, you never know, you know, you like this guy to carry the ball this many times, or the classic one is how many catches you want guys to have. Well, you know, who's, who's open and who's not, that, that's that's the one. But him running it is an integral part of your offense. Well, no one said the tight end caught the ball last week. That's true. Well, I did, I said What was going on? You know, I think uh, I don't know that anyone uh, would be those guys. If you were to ask them, would hey, how'd you do it? And say I got improved. We got improved. Justin would probably tell you the same thing. You know, but as far as um, you know, grading a winning performance where we'd like for it to be, just, Justin did. You know, and there were some other guys a little bit shy of that. They got to keep improving. You know, who had some good okay starts, but let's, you know, they they got to keep getting better. You know, they have really good size, quickness. Um, they they got some explosive guys up front, um, and great speed throughout the whole defense. Um, and you know, it's kind of misleading because they have four starters back. You know, if you put up a personnel sheet that we can give our guys, it says four. But all the guys have played. You know, it's not like anyone on the field is their first time out there, you know, and, and uh, they're experienced, you know, because most of the time the way they win football games, guys have gotten a lot of reps. So uh, they're good. They're really good. Um, not absolutely sure, but I, um, that would be a hard one for me to answer for sure. But I, uh, I don't know that it'll be that long, you know, but I, I, I think um, I have to check on that. I hadn't really thought about that. To drill it into them, no, I, I don't I don't think so. I think that, you know, when you uh, when you're blocking for him I think you get you know, it's not that it's not mentioned, you know, but I mean you get used to knowing that um, one of his uh, strengths is allowing a play to last a little bit longer. You know, he's a pretty evasive guy. You never know exactly what he's going to do, but uh, just like on that first touchdown last week, you know, protection wasn't really bad at all. He looked at the film, but 
he, he stepped up through there, which causes some problems in the back, you know, for the way those guys are covered. Uh, so they made a great break back on the route he was running and got open. So, um, uh, you know, he's one of those kind of guys that one of his big secrets is when he starts moving around like that, he doesn't just run. He keeps his eyes down the field and, and looks to make some plays. You know, where some guys, they'll get to a point and things aren't looking exactly how they want and they'll just take off. Well, you know, he keeps his eyes on the field and keeps looking for things, which is a, which is a unique ability, I think, that he has. Was he like that last year? Was he like that last year? Oh, yeah.